Hello everyone, Regina here with Refuge One Herbal Teacup and More and Bubbles of Love. Today I want to talk to you about podcasting. If you are a podcaster and you want to get your content uploaded to YouTube, as you know, you need certain platforms to do that. I'm here to tell you that you really don't, and I'm going to show you what you need in order to upload your content to YouTube, Instagram, and other platforms like that. As we know, Spotify plays a big role and lead in podcasts. They're totally different than ACX, Authors Republic. Those are narrating platforms. Let me show you what I mean. We have ACX for narrators. We have ACX also for those that want to get their books. If you're already a published author and you want to have your books uploaded to ACX on an audio form, then you know ACX is the one for you. Authors Republic is also the website for you. As we know, you can do nothing with the platforms like this ACX or Authors Republic without an Amazon KDP account. You need those. I'm going to show you about that, but today we're talking about podcasting. You can use Podbean or you can also use um, Buzzsprout to get your content out there as well. Audacity is a good one that I use. You do not need, I'm here to tell you right now, you don't need Buzzsprout or Podbean. There's nothing wrong with these um, platforms. There's nothing wrong with Buzzsprout. I did do Buzzsprout. I did do Podbean until I found out that there were different ways that you could do these things and to get your content uploaded. We know that with certain platforms, depending on what you're wanting to do, if you want to be a narrator, then you're going to go on the ACX side of it or off the Republic side of it. But if you're wanting to do podcasts, then we know that we need to do something very simple like um, podcasters by Spotify. Spotify podcasters is a platform that you need. You need an account for them in order to, for them to bleed over to certain platforms on your behalf. Let me show you what I mean. On Spotify podcasters, you have what you call a podcast availability page. When you set your account up, you'll be able to find that in your settings and uh, on your uh, podcast availability page. Your podcast availability page lets you know that uh, podcaster Spotify for podcasters is 100% holding arms with Spotify. Anything that you do on Spotify for podcasters will reflect and upload on Spotify. You have what is called a RSS distribution website. This is your RR RSS feed. All you have to do is copy that and upload it to any one of these. Let me show you this right here real quick. Upload it to any one of these platforms and you will be able to. I'm going to put all of these links in the descriptions that the, all you have to do is click on them. Amazon, um, Google Podcasts, iHeartRadio, all of these, if you start a Spotify podcasters platform, they will automatically put your content on Amazon Music, Apple Podcasts, CastBox, Google Podcasts, iHeartRadio, Overcast, Pocket Cast, and Radio Public you will not have access to your um, YouTube. You will have to do that yourself. And you do not need a subscription anywhere to do it. 
you are going to be able to upload your content to YouTube. Hello, everyone. Regina here with oh, let me pause that real quick. As you can see, these are my podcasts. Once you put in your RSS uh, website, it will automatically, whatever you do on podcasters, will generate. This is the storyteller with another. All of it will generate to YouTube, every last bit of it. So you only need to do it one time. Hello, everyone. Regina here. With I've got these set. But as you can see, all of my podcasts are now uploaded. For narrating, if you visit my page, Bogesey, B-O-G-E-S-E-Y, you'll be able to listen to how to become a narrator. And it will tell you about each and every one of these ACX, Arthur's Republic, and how to get your content on there and how to upload it. Uh, there are techniques, uh, requirements uh, with Arthur Republic is a little bit. Arthur Republic is very different. I'm not going to say a little bit. It's very different because the technique uh, requirements are different. You have to be consistent in overall sound and format matting. You have to be composed of, of all mono or all stereo uh, files, including opening and closing credits in separate audio tracks include a separate track between one to five minutes in length and contain only one chapter or section per audio file. Be no longer than 78 minutes each. That is for Author Republic. And this is just a sample for you guys so that you'll you'll see. So Podbean, podcasting for Podbean and Buzzsprout, you do not need to subscribe in order to be able to upload your content. Let's talk about podcasting first. The only thing that you need to do is start a Spotify podcasters account and then start uploading your audio, your podcast to YouTube. And again, I'm going to show you how to do that. All of these links are accessible. All you're going to have to do is just click on them. YouTube and all platforms require video files, so you'll need to convert your audio files to an MP3 or MP4. I used Audacity because you need some kind of video element in order to upload podcasts to YouTube. So in, in, in order to do that, let's talk about Audacity. Audacity is free. Audacity will allow you to edit your content, Upload your content, turn your content into an MP3, and get it uploadable. This is a sample right here, and I'm going to show you what it is. You may want to invest. If you're going to do it from your PC, you know, invest in your nice microphone, um, you know, to, to be able to do it. I like doing everything from my computer because uh, even though a lot of things are device-friendly, I'm not device friendly, <laughs> so I mean, I, I need a crash helmet for real. So, but we're going to, I'm going to show you what I mean. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Audacity will allow you to come in and you will be able to adjust your waves. You will be able to go in and adjust your format from a 32 to say a 16. You'll be able to uh, edit your content. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. And then you'll be able to go in and you'll be able to edit that. Bring it together. Say you burp doing a, a um, <laughs> segment. That's a human factor right there. Or someone walks in your room or your phone rings. You'll be able to edit all of that out and it'll sound like this. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. See? So it will allow you to do that. And then it will also allow you to effectively go in and get your noise grids down. It will help you to amplify and edit your content. Because what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to do a passing stage. 
and you're going to want it to that's not going to pass i can tell you that because it blew up too much so let's see you, you also acx will also allow you to put uh an analyzer on here too to see this right here this is what this says right here in order for you to upload anything to acx and um, Authors Republic, these have to say pass, pass, pass. That doesn't say pass. So what uh, Audacity will allow you to do is come back in and amplify, change your format and change everything. Analyze it until you're able to get it to pass. So let's try to do something different here. You see how I got that one to pass? And then you're gonna do that also with, with everything else. And this Audacity will allow you to go in. And there's your RMS uh, normalizer right there. It will allow you to go in and set values and change it all around until you come back in and then get everything to pass the inspection that is needed. for it to pass and to be uploaded. And you see how that changed from the five to the four. And then you'll just have to keep doing that. I'm gonna see that this is a sample, but I'm gonna show you something um, that I did do on your computer. Once everything downloads, you'll have your content that will, you can choose the file for it. But as you can see, I have uh, this one here that I've done and you see everything passes. So this is actually able to go and be uploaded to the platforms that have certain criteria that you do have to meet in order to get your content uploaded to different uh, platforms say like um author republic if you decide that you want to start narrating so that you can go on and start making money then you know you go on and you make you choose your auditions and and everything now for as far as narrating you have to set up a a profile and then all the submissions that you get you'll have to um, use that criteria to build your platforms this uh so that they'll pass the to get it up on the platforms now this one right here this is an audition that i i did you have to be precise with your pricing as well this is one that um was uh, 175,000 words that's 175 words per minute um the total cost was 1960 dollars that goes to me um and then you do an explanation of why it costs that much this was a big book and there was over 24 hours and 23 minutes worth of time. You charge per finished hour. That's what you charge for. You charge per finished hour. So you can charge anywhere from 60 to $300 an hour, depending on your equipment, depending on um, your knowledge and your pricing. It just depends on you. Because remember, you have to go in and you have to edit everything out. You have to go in and edit through Audacity. You have to get it ready to upload to uh, ACX. You have to get it ready to go in and, and upload it to, you know, your, your podcast for it to be clear and precise. Now with podcast, um, Spotify podcasters, you can edit your content right from your phone or your computer. So that's the good thing about that. With the ACX or with Author Republic, you do have to go in and do certain things. And if you have any questions about it, they will lead you in audiobook distribution, audio narration, audiobook production. They will show you how to, to um, do all the techniques that is required to start making money and uh, become a narrator and also a producer for hire uh, as well. With that being said, also getting back to podcasters, you can listen to, again, like I said, you can listen to how to become a narrator. 
And then all of those links, if you want to give it a go, because you have absolutely nothing to lose. You can download these platforms and you can go in and build your profile and you can give it a go. The first time I did a narrating um, book for Arthur's Republic, I only charged $60 an hour. The book was only three hours, but it gave me a taste for I wanted more. So I, you know, of course, went in to get more and start building the platforms. I'm not a professional. I'm just getting started just like everyone else with my podcasts, with my my books. I've got several books that I've published and also turning into audio. If you are a published author and you want to narrate your own books, these platforms will help you to do that. You can become your own book narrator and save yourself money. But to get your books uploaded to, say, YouTube and platforms like that, then these links that I'm going to provide for you is going to be at the end of the page in the description at the end of this video. I will say this too. Just like with anything, if you want to get your books narrated and then put them on platforms like ACX and uh, Authors Republic, then you need to upload them to KDP. That's Kindle Direct Publishing with Amazon. And just like you can't do anything without Amazon, KDP, and get your books on platforms, you can't do anything with your podcasts because everything bleeds off of Spotify podcasters. It goes to Spotify and then Spotify takes it and distributes it distributes it everywhere else except on YouTube. But that's up to you. And then you're going to be limited. Like I said, you're going to be very limited with um, with these that they do help you with. They'll upload a few, maybe not all. You maybe see one or two. It takes a while, but you can go ahead and upload it directly. The Amazon Music, Apple Podcasts, iHeartRadio. Everybody wants their podcast on iHeartRadio. And iHeartRadio, each season, they have uh, podcast awards that you can actually submit your uh, podcast to and win all these great prizes and things like that. So these awards, so you have an opportunity to get your podcasts recognized by big platforms. And you can go on and you can, um, iHeartRadio, set you up accounts. They're all free. If you're a podcaster, set yourself up some accounts so that you can get out there. So that's my tip for today, how to get your podcast on YouTube and other platforms and how to advance even farther on Spotify podcasters. So that's my tip for today. Guys, like my page, subscribe, dig my website, refuge1herbalteacupandmore.org. This is Regina Sanford with Herbal Teacup and More and Bubbles of Love. Happy podcasting is not that hard. Just get into it. All of the links are in the description, even down to ACX. All you have to do is click on the link and start building. Happy podcasting. Don't forget about Audacity too. Three things. Spotify podcasters, Audacity, and start building and uploading right from your PC or your device. Bye.